So we're going to go over how to do fishtails and some ghosting and how to do some fishtail flips. So first, the fishtail. Uh, the fishtail, I'm taking the hoop in my right hand, moving it forward, kind of almost like a little bit like a toss, right? So it's a toss, 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 toss. So notice I'm tossing it in the air and catching it with my opposite side. I'm going to change orientation to face the camera and observe how when I make the toss, I'm doing the catch on the opposite side of my body, right? So I'm going to, again, toss, catch on the opposite side, 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 catch on the opposite side. The opposite side. It's important to catch on the opposite side because if you don't catch on the opposite side, look what's going to happen. Catch in the middle, oh, oh my God, now I've got a poop in my face. It's not fun. So we want to catch on the opposite side, okay? One more time just from the back so you can see what's happening here. So again, starting with my right hand side, launching it up into the air and catching on the opposite side. Bump, 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 okay. So that's the fishtail. Fishtail flip is, what is gonna happen is I'm going to carry the hoop all the way around. And at no point when I carry this all the way around am I going to grab on the hoop. I'm going to let the centripetal force keep the hoop uh, glued on the back of my hand. So again, I'm going to start with the fishtail. So here I go. Bump, bump, bump. Now here comes that flip. One point to point out is that when I'm done with the flip, I let the hoop rotate one more time down here. So I'll point it out for the camera. Uh, so, so when you're doing it, you're trying to practice it. So launch, launch, launch. Notice there's that flip. Launch, launch, launch. There's that flip again. See? So that's the fishtail and fishtail flip. The final uh, point for this little routine is we're going to transition out of the fishtail into doing a kind of a ghosting move. And the ghosting move is going to look like this. Okay? Now the mechanics are similar to the fish, fish hook, right? Uh, the difference mainly being that unlike when you're doing this, you're never grabbing onto the hoop. When you're doing this, you most certainly are grabbing onto the bottom of the hoop. And what you do is you transition, thumb up like your phone saying, hey, hooping is cool. Yeah, all right. And then you're pushing down, and then your ghost hand matches and mirrors, right? And I'm endeavoring to try to keep my ghost hand at 12 o'clock as much as possible. But when you're learning how to do this move, don't let perfection be the enemy of the good enough, okay? Especially when you're practicing. But as much as possible, I am ghosting it from side to side. Okay, so I want, we want to keep this video pretty short, so I'm going to now illustrate all three moves pretty quickly and then we'll call this a wrap. All right, so here we go. <clears throat> we start with the fish hook. Toss, 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 toss. Catching on the other side, going around. Now I'm going to go to that ghosting move. Uh, my name is Paul. This is at Fort Awesome in uh, August of 2016. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Peace.